Today we're going to be fishing in a tier 6 red zone and seeing how long it takes to fill up a fisherman's journal. We're in tier 8 fishing gear. This is very risky. Uh, this is uh, over one, about 1 1.3 million in risk. I don't think we're going to make that much in one hour. It'll probably take 45 minutes to fill this journal. And uh, we have an escape set in Vizpots, Orc Pie, uh, Dual Sword with Iron Will, so we can't be purged when we are using Wanderlust. So here we go. Let's hope, uh, you know, we don't get ganked out here. And we're going to see how much we earn. And as soon as I uh, go uninvis here and start fishing, I reckon we will start the timer. Also, maybe I should have brought a stronger weapon to fight these dudes, but I think we'll be okay. So let's go uninvis here. And, yeah, we're with an aggro range of the golem. We'll start the timer after we kill the golem here. Which, uh, I'm silenced for a few more seconds. Not a big deal. There's no gankers on the map. We're safe right now. And so, I'm not really too too afraid. But let's go ahead and kill this guy. We'll start the timer in just a sec. And right, we're gonna see how much we earn here. Right now, my inventory is worth 135,000. So, we're gonna see that number go up over time. And let's eat the pork pie and let's begin. Fishing is probably the worst gathering profession in the entire game because it is, it, it is the most overly botted. It is hand cramping. It is boring. You only can run in a 180 degree direction most of the time when ganked. It is the slowest. It is it, it, the fish only really sell during a few times per year. That is during fame weeks. If you wanted to actually make a true profit. It's used in, you know, build, making chef food better for enchanting it, basically, and not much else. Fish on its own aren't really that useful. There's many other foods in the game just directly more useful than fishing. Something needs to be done. Like, fishing really needs a massive overhaul. Maybe some kind of bonus loot, some kind of bonus drops. Filling the, the, the cool thing is you can fill Tier 8 journals in any zone. It just takes forever. It took me 45 minutes in a Tier, what is this, 6 red zone? I could do it in the same amount of time in a tier 5 yellow zone mist with an Avalonian fishing rod. I'm just using a regular tier 8 fishing rod here because I'm not going to risk 2 extra million for a 20% gain. The math doesn't add up on that. And what I'm doing is extremely highly dangerous and you should never do it just because the gains aren't worth it, which I will share with you later on in the video. So again, uh, I just purely made this video to prove a point to all those Redditors and all those haters that the red zone, the black zone, it's not worth it. You make more silver in the yellow zones fishing. You make more silver in the blue zone skinning than doing this. There's no reason to ever do it. If I can go back in time, I would just never have picked up fishing at all. It is a complete, utter waste. It's a silver sink. It is not worth it. And uh, yes, other fishermen started showing up. And so it got a little bit s slower to fish some of the um, uh, fishing holes. But that's just how it is, and um, yeah, I had to clear out the mobs there too. But essentially, this is a absolute garbage activity, and I just want to show you in video form why it sucks. Other people making, you know, Silver Farm videos about fishing, they're just bullshitting you. There it is, 44 minutes, 23 seconds. Now, I will say we filled this journal. I, I don't remember the exact time when I did it in a Tier 5 Yellow Zone, but it was around 45 minutes. So the fact that I'm doing this in a tier 6 red zone, and it is the same exact time, I can tell you why that is. The reason why is because I'm using a regular tier 8 fishing rod, and I'm not using an Avalonian tier 8 fishing rod. The Avalonian is a 15% increase, I believe it is. No, a 20% increase in yield. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> it's yellow zone beats red zone. What can I say? Now, let's... um chunk this stuff in the bank let's uh chuck her you just chuck her in there now let's find out how much this is worth and i'm also going to give you an estimated amount um without the journal with the journal uh so putting the tool away and with the journal we made 447,000 silver in um 44 minutes so that's about 10,000 silver a minute if you want to look at it like that right so 10,000 silver a minute in 10 minutes, it's 100,000. So 40 minutes would be 400,000. And then 44 minutes would be 40, 447,000. You get the idea, right? 10,000 10, 10, silver a minute in the red zone. That's with the journal. Now, if you don't fill journals, how much is it worth? 303,000. Yikes. That is, uh, that's pretty bad. That's, uh, that's in 44 minutes, right? So it would be about 400,000 silver per hour, uh, in the red zone. And, um... If you were to have premium, that would be maybe six to eight hundred thousand an hour. Um, 
again, that's without journals. With the journals per hour, you add uh, 150k to that. So it's still under 1 million per hour. We're risking like 1.3 million. We're risking 1.3 million and we're only making like a fraction of that. It would take like three hours to break even. And I'm going to tell you, we would totally die in those three hours. I'm playing at the dead of night in the morning uh, in a zone that's not very crowded during a weekday. So uh, if I did this on the weekend, if I did this, uh, you know, during a, the prime time or in any other crowded zone, I think I saw four fishermen and two non-fishermen my entire time out there. Uh, also, um, please don't add me to friends list unless you are in the Discord and you pass the questionnaire. Anyway, that's the video proving once again red zone fishing is inadequate. And uh, you can be like, well, what about tier? What about tier seven? What about tier eight? What about black zone, bro? It's like, okay, there's not a single tier seven or tier eight zone anywhere in the entire game that isn't filled with clan baddies in a Discord ready to murder you and take all your stuff. So, like, even if I had a giant horse instead of the wild boar. Even if I had, like, you know, tier 8, whatever, dual swords, it doesn't matter. I'm still going to die and lose everything. And even then, I would only be making very slightly more silver per hour. Yes, I w it is more silver per hour, but at a higher risk. And it's it's such a low amount that it's just not worth doing. You just go to a yellow zone mist and you fish there completely free, worry-free, zero risk. You can watch anime while you do it. You can listen to music. You can... Watch Twitch streams and YouTube videos while you do it. Whereas in the red zone, I am focused. I have to freaking con... Like, I this number down at the bottom right, I had to check that every single time I casted my fishing line and stared at it. And in the area I was fishing in, quite dangerous because people can go invis. They can go right off your screen, flag up. Their invis wears out. They just run you down. That uh, This guy that I was fishing with, I actually wanted to be uh, make a video where I was going to kill him. Uh, he... Uh, Hold on, where's he at? Why is Say Chat not showing up in my windows? Anyway, he was very friendly. This this guy, this it bomb it bombs guy. I could totally get a gank set. I got one right here. I can go out behind him and just pop him and take his fish. He hasn't been fishing very long, so he wouldn't really be worth anything. And no, bro, I'm not Chinese. I'm simply muted. I can't reply to you. Um, <laughs> but with that said. There is zero reason for me to go fish in a red zone. The risk is too great. The earnings are... I mean, I don't even think this is better than a yellow zone be because I can't use the Avalonian fishing rod. I am already risking over a million, like I said, 1.3 million with this set. And uh, it ain't worth it. ain't worth it, bro. Anyway, that's all I got. Thank you so much. Leave a like on the video because those elitist clan douchebags will try to downvote this video. And they will try to get you to lure you out to the red and black zones to gank you and take your stuff. I'm here to protect you and provide you with the truth, the real numbers, and show you that the earnings simply aren't worth it. Hell, I can earn way more silver in a tier 4 blue zone skinning. I mean, fishing are, is already bad thanks to the bots. But also, there's one last thing I need you to do. And I need you to click the video on the right side of your screen. And if you don't, the next time you go to a fast food place... The only people working there will be crackheads and, and ex-convicts, and they're going to leave all the sauce out of whatever it is you order. They're going to be give you the, the least amount of ingredients possible, and they're going to short you on any kind of meat products you may order. So if you order a sandwich, it's going to ha it's gonna be dry, and it's going to be missing the roast beef. I'm not even kidding. F screw you, Subway. I'm mad.